Hey guys, Jvx Penguin here, and today I have the Exploiter S by Skyrover. Um, I just, whoa, <laughs> I just bought this from Walmart. I'm gonna try and find a link, put it online, find a link online, so you guys can get this too. Um, it's pretty big. Yeah, it's a big helicopter. It's, I think it's like 15 inches. So, it's an outdoor helicopter, which is, I, I really like, because all my other helicopters are indoor. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. It's a gyro engine, turbo speed, that's cool. There's an actual AC adapter instead of the cheap cable that comes out of your controller. I hate that. And then 2.4 gigahertz for the operating system. Six way control. Just another picture. See. It's too dark in here without the light on. Uh, balance bar, main blade. I've never seen the balance bar below the top blade. It's interesting. Protection, that's nice. Tail blade rotor. I should get all of them, but they're. I spent $58 on this. <laughs> Installation instructions. I'm blinding myself right now. But apparently, on the controller. Let's see. Trimmer. Turbo engine, those turbo, yay. Power indicators right there, a light switch. It's apparently there's a light on it. And probably right in the front there, that silver thing in the bottom. So let's open this, ah, oh, it's taped. Um, so, so professional. So professional. <laughs> Snip. The question is, can I do this with one hand? Yes, I can. Using my feet. My socks have grips on the bottom. <laughs> Where's the control? Oh, it's way down there. Ooh. Maybe I'm supposed to open it on the other side. Let's try this again. Now it wants to go the other way. Um, one second. <laughs> Have fun viewing the camera. There we go. Got it. So it's a nice size controller. Oh, really? Have to unscrew screws. Be even more professional. I can show you guys the rest of my RC stuff. All in there. Yeah, that's where it is. Look at the back too. You guys, you guys get to see the back behind the scenes right now because I'm too lazy to edit this right now. I have to do a little bit of editing, aka okay, combining it. So I'm not going to record this one again. Okay.
that connector. <laughs> it's kind of like a square. And then it looks like it has an indicator light on there already. Ah, uh, my hand's getting tired. Oh, gosh, there we go. F4, vertical or floor mount position. Never heard of that. second. My battery's about to die. <laughs> in the controller, but there's a little piece of paper inside. Let's see what it is. I have not, I haven't looked at this yet. It's the first time I've unfolded it. Frequency repairing instructions. Move the power switch on the helicopter to on, and place the helicopter on the flat surface. Duh. Move the power switch on the controller to on position. It's not going to work otherwise. <laughs> the controller and helicopter will pair automatically about 3-5 to five seconds. Yeah, they always do that. That's how you pair almost any helicopter. <laughs> um, these are batteries I got recently. They're by Sun Labs. Got them off of Amazon. Um, they're rechargeable batteries. They work awesome. I'm using them in all of my cars. Oh, I need AAAs, really.
helicopter. It's upside down. It's wonderful. <laughs> yeah, I keep everything in like this is my helicopter. Um, got it from a place called Bargain Nook. It's like a kind of like a thrift shop a little bit. The quadcopter. I don't think I've done a review on this yet. It claims to be the world's smallest helicopter. I don't think it is, but it's really small and it's awesome. Um, don't have the helicopter. Well, still ha have the helicopter. Have the helicopter. Neo and work. This goes to this one. Bonus video. Um, this goes to the car. Just really broken. Batteries. blades, an extra blade for the back, and then a couple of little rings that connect right here for the stabilizer. Yeah. I kind of like the wings on it. Cheap plastic, but yeah, I barely put any pressure in spending. And then there's the light on the charger. It's supposed to turn like green, I think, when it's just on charging. So hopefully it'll do that soon. I really want to fly this thing. I'm gonna be kinda stupid and do this. I'm not gonna fly it. Okay, so it only controls the front. Yeah. So I'm gonna finish charging this. And then I'm going to fly it. Hopefully. My sibling's gonna be home soon, so it's gonna get loud. But I'll see you guys when this helicopter is charged up. Okay guys, I finally got some like people working on our house. I finally got the helicopter outside. Let's fly. Sorry if the camera's a little bit shaky. I have my phone sitting on top of my controller. This is so hard. Whoops. Oh no. 
Good. I have flown this a bunch of times. Uh, it's been about a week. I can get this thing up in the air. That's so weird. Um, don't want to go over the neighbor's fence because I'm not going to be able to get it. This thing does fly really well. I love it. I'm just being a bad pilot right now. That's the helicopter in flight. Um, I'm not very good at keeping it up in the air while holding my phone. Oops. But it's super durable. I've. Ugh. So if you look at the blades, they're all chipped up. Um, I've flown them into that tree, um, I've hit our garage, I've hit our house. So yeah, this helicopter is pretty good. Um, $50 as I said earlier. I really loved it. And so yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.